backups, right? We're all so scared of losing our data. We're all so scared of losing our pictures. And when we lose them, we get mad because we don't have a backup. Now, it's better to prevent than to cure. And today we're gonna see how we can prevent data loss by using the file history tool built in in Windows 10. All right, so we're gonna start off by going into the Explorer, going to this PC, and then you can plug in your hard drive and wait for it to be recognized by the Explorer. And as we can see over here, there's a one terabyte hard drive. And we're gonna rename that to something else just to make it easier for us. And we're gonna name this backup. Okay, so now we can close the Explorer window and go into the start button, click the settings going into update and security and go to backup. Now the only thing we need to do is flick this little switch over here, put it on, then go to more options and normally the backup should already be configured for you since this is the only hard drive. Now I'm going to show you how to do the same thing should you have multiple external hard drives plugged in so you can define which hard drive you want to use to perform your backups. All right, so now we're going into this PC and as you can see, I've added a secondary hard drive, which is also named backup. So what we need to do now is go to the start button and right click it, go to control panel and then search in this list for file history. Now click select drive and wait for the list of available drives to load and click the hard drive you want to use. I'm gonna change it to the other hard drive, the 500 gigabyte one and click OK. When it asks you if you want to move your existing files to the new location, you can click yes. Do take note that uh, file history does a lot more than only make a backup. It also keeps track of different versions of a file uh, or files. So you can always recall to previous versions should you run into trouble uh, with one of your files. Now let's say you want to add a custom directory. Let's say you have like a whole hard drive you want to backup. Like me, I have one dedicated hard drive that's full of data and I want to make a backup of that. That's very easy to do. Just go to the start button again and go into the settings. Then to update and security, backup again, go back into the more options. And in the options below, you can add a folder and select your hard drive or your folder, whatever, and click choose this folder. Now over here, you can change the interval of backups and also how long the PC should keep the backups. So when all that's done, if after you selected your options or left everything at default, you can click backup now and then just let that run in the background and close the window. So as you can see, the backup has completed and we can see the size of the backup right over here. So that's good. All the files are backed up. Great. Simple as that. Now leave the hard drive plugged in. Don't pull it out and make sure you check every now and then that the backup is still running. Thanks for watching guys. See you later.